Welcome in tonight's TV. Tommy the V of Viola here with a, a very special guest right now, of course, as we join you on Knights TV and the uh, final games here at Knights Stadium. And of course, the final game in the history of this ballpark, September 2nd. It's Monday, 2.15. And I'm here talking to Eddie Waddell, who has spent countless hours at this ballpark, Eddie, of course. And uh, you've been here since, uh, since day one of this ballpark. And first off, Eddie, uh, it talks to me about what you feel like the, the last game is going to mean for you. Okay. It's going to be sad in a way because I've been here since, uh, like I said, day one. I've seen a lot of people come and go, and it's, it's, been, a, it's been a great ride as far as and we've seen a lot of players through the years, and, and I've had a great time. Yeah, you have. And uh, so as the fans are watching this, and Eddie, you've, you've been with the Charlotte Knights since 1988. You worked over in Charlotte uh, in the clubhouse. 89 temporary facility. You mm -hmm. worked there as well. And then here at Knight Stadium, since 1990, you, you've yes. been working with these guys and you, you've gone from the visiting side to the home side. Tell us a little bit about what you do on a daily basis here at the ballpark. Well, my main job is we, um, I do the uniforms for the visiting teams, uh, the personals and everything they have. Uh, we're, we're mainly equipment managers to keep everything in line, but I mainly do all the uniforms and the personals and get them ready for the next day. Yeah. And, and so you've been doing that for, for a number of years. Is there a day or a memory or, or something that sticks out to you most of the 24 years here at this ballpark? I would say it's when we're, we're playing like the exhibition games with the White Sox and, and get to see the, the uh, big league players come in and get to work with them and all. And uh, it's, they, uh, they treat you well and everything when they first come in. And uh, I've, I've had a great time with them. Once again, sitting here with Eddie Wandell, who works in the visiting clubhouse. He's been here for 24 years. And, and Eddie, you were here in 1993, a very special season, of yeah. course. Jim Tomey, Manny Ramirez, Charlie Manuel. Mm -hmm. any, any memories that stick out to you from that year? I can remember it seemed like uh, it was like Murder's Row when they'd come up to hit. Uh, you had Jim Tomey first and Manny Ramirez and Sam Horn. And it seemed like they'd go back to back to back a lot of times on the home run. So it was, it was really interesting. Uh, you'd hear, he used to play Danger Zone all the time on the outfield speaker system. And it seemed like you could hear that in the locker room every time, just, just constantly. So they, they had a good hitting team that year. Yep, yeah, they were, uh, and they, of course they won the International League Championship that first year. They were even uh, in existence. So that was very good. Very special year, of course. Uh, 1990, first season. Anything that sticks out to you? This is a brand new ballpark at that point. Uh, the castle, as it was known. Anything stick out to you from that first uh, first game or first uh, few games? Well, when we first tried to get the stadium going that first day, we had a day game, and it seemed like it it rained about the third inning, and it, we actually had a rain out. And uh, I remember the mud everywhere from the, all the stuff coming into the dugouts, and it it was a mess on a on the opening day. So we actually closing out on a day game as well as we had opened up a day game here. So it was, it's going to be interesting. Yeah, a lot, a lot, of, uh, a lot of great memories for you, Eddie. Uh, one last thing I'd like to ask you. Um, we talked about moments. H how would you like to have this stadium be remembered? What, 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 when someone says to you, Knight Stadium, what, 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 what brings to your mind? What, what, what are some of those things that you say, this is what this ballpark was? I mean, it's it's been 24 years of my life, basically. I've it's ever ever summer working it, and uh, I just I'm I hate to see it go. I know they're gonna knock it down here soon, and it's gonna be a part of me that goes out with it. So, but I'm I've had a I've had a great blast here, and I'm I'm hoping to go uptown and start a new chapter. Well, that's great, Eddie. As I said, Eddie Waddell here, he's worked in uh, a number of clubhouses, of course, back in, in Charlotte in 88 with the Knights, their first year, 89, a temporary facility right back here in Fort Mill. And of course, at this beautiful ballpark here in Fort Mill at Knights Stadium since 1990. So Eddie, 26 years of service for the Charlotte Knights. We thank you so much. And I know you're going to be a big part of, uh, of the final, the closing moments uh, on Monday. We thank you for your time today. Okay. Thank you, sir. Uh, All right. There he is. Eddie. Eddie Waddell, a Charlotte native who has been with the Charlotte Knights since 1988 and uh, a lot of great memories at this ballpark. And it all comes to a close on Monday, September 2nd. I'm Tommy Navi of Viola. We'll see you next time right here on Knights TV.